Hey guys, it's Fish, and I'm back with another episode of The Walking Dead. And in the last episode, uh, it, it probably wasn't the most exciting episode. We did get the train going, though. Uh, and we met Chuck here, who was pretty much talking to the others while I was on the train. A uh, bit weird that uh, the other the kid didn't do anything about it, but he got candy, so I'm, I'm sure he's happy. But uh, we've got stuff that we've got to keep going. So let's give Katya the bottle of water. Here. Found some water. Oh, thank you. Perfect. And we took it from Chuck, and he didn't really seem to care. Is that right? That's all I can keep thinking about. Like, somehow that matters. It doesn't. I know. Well, I don't. But you're probably right. We just have to... Would you have left Lily back there? On the side of the road like that? Yes, Lee. Yeah? We have to have lines. Yes, I would have left her. Okay, then. It was a tough choice, but I think... Has Clementine said anything to I you think I was about right. Carly or Duck or anything? I'm worried about her. No. <laughs> that little girl is a puzzle. Yeah, she is. Poor Carly. Where did yesterday go? I don't know. Are you okay? I know you were fond of her. I was. This isn't any time for, you know, romance, but yeah. I was, uh, fond of her, yeah. How's that? Tired, which could mean a lot of things, right? Yeah. His body's probably fighting whatever's in it. Exactly. Anyway, let me know if anything changes here. Alright, cool. Uh, I think we're done with her. Duck has just disappeared. She's clutching at nothing. <laughs> oh, awesome. Alright, let's talk ben. With ben. I'm watching the girls and not working on a mega cool train. What do you think? No. I would have let him work on the train. I do and watching the girls and not working on a mega cool train. What do you think? Yeah, I would have let him work on the train. Hey, sweet pea. Kenny was that a candy bit. Chuck gave you. It taste okay? It was really good. No funny aftertaste? No. Train's cool, huh? I guess. Scary kind of. Hmm. Okay. Let's have a chat to Chuck then. Hey, Chuck. Honey. Where are you from? You live around here? Georgia boy. You saw where I live. Why are you alone? Why not? Seem to be doing all right. Fine then. I'm sorry. I do like being around y'all. Actually, it's nice. You caught us on a bad day. Mm. We still got a couple of kids. And this one's got a good spirit. That's some kind of something. I suppose I'll you talk don't. Talk to you later. Hope so. Well, I suppose you don't have to deal with people just going crazy if you're on your own. Because you're the only one that can go crazy. So that's it? We're cut loose? Seems that way, yeah. Great. We don't got much left, so just gather whatever you have. Let's go. Want to ride? Well, it sounds like you're taking my home. That's a yes, then. Haven't found anything better for keeping the creepy crawlies out than that boxcar. True. Duck's sick. Get on the train, Clementine. He's getting sicker. Let me look at him. Is the train really a good idea with Duck like that? Maybe we should focus on one thing at a time. Yes. What can we do here? We get on the train and we find something better. That is the plan. I think Lee just wants to talk it through. 
It's talked through. Get on, Kent. Come on, Kenny. I'll be up front. I don't want to hear any nonsense until we get where we're going. And then what? Duck will be sick before then. He'll turn before that. We're going to have to deal with him on a boxcar. And we're going. That's it. But how much, uh, how much fuel can we have? Can't be that much. You gotta be hard on you, eh? Three adults taking care of three kids. No disrespect, son. There were more of us. Dad, get them? Yes. Oh, it's a shame. Lee! Lee, I need you right now. I need you to go get Ken. What's up? If you get that off his face, my hands are full here. Alright. Thank you. Could you just get that off his face, please? Yep. He's, He's out of time. We need to stop this train. Okay. Please. Alright. Kenny's gonna have to live with that realization. And it was all well and good when it was other people's family, but I, I honestly think he's going to rage hard on this one. And he already is. He's already fighting it with, you know, anger. Bit of bravado to prevent us from being able to talk about it. You need to stop the train. Duck's just about gone back there, man. Don't feed me that bullshit. He'll be fine. I'm sorry. I shouldn't talk like that right now. Go back there and tell my wife everything will be fine. What is the goddamn deal? He's a little sick, but we can't just quit. It's a scratch. He's not like the others. Jesus, all y'all are just making it worse. Stop the train. Stop it, goddammit! Fuck you, Lee. You're gonna listen. Or what? What the hell is wrong with you? You need to lock it up. Be a man here. Oh, you want a piece of me? Is that it? I just want to talk here and relax. Then talk. think you're the reason Duck was bitten? Like you had this coming or something? You didn't kill Herschel's son. Yes, I did. And now it's catching up to me. That's not what went down. You looked out for your kid. A bad thing happened to someone else's. There ain't no way this world lets my son live when I help put someone else's in the ground. That's not the way it works. You know that. True. Stop the train, man. Yes. I didn't want to fight him. I wanted him to, to step down himself. And I think we have. I'm really happy that we talked him down. Because I didn't want to have to fight him.
again. It's... I think it's time. The boy's been bit, in case you haven't figured that out. Take as long as you need. There ain't no time left to take. What are we gonna do? We can't allow him to become one of those things. But what if... what if he doesn't? Kenny, I love you very much. I love our son more than life itself. I need you to hear me. What you are saying, that he may not turn, is foolish. But... No. There's... Come on, Cap. If you think of one, you let me know. Isn't there some sort of pill or something we can just give him? Stop it. Just drift off to sleep. Right, hon? I mean, Jesus, this is our son. I know. But we know it's... Here, or nothing. Oh, fuck. Just who, then? You want me to? You don't have to. I'll do it. No, you don't have to. I'll do it. No, it should be a parent. No parent should have to do something like this. Lee's right, Cat. We can say our goodbyes and just let that be it. I don't know. Lee, you'd be doing this family a great service. Why don't we take him into the forest, so Clementine doesn't have to see? Yeah. Give us a moment to say goodbye. Of course. sure he's okay. But how? He's bitten. By making sure he doesn't come back. Oh. Look, Clem. Things are... What the... No! Ben, take Clementine into the train. Go. It'll be fine. They've done it without me. No, they didn't have a gun, so what happened? Someone shot Cat, yeah. Cat! Cat! Gotcha! Oh, she shot herself. Why? Oh, wow. Cat! Honey! Oh, fucking God! <laughs> what the hell happened? What did you. She could. She. 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 Just... Oh. Oh, oh, fuck! was rough. What do we do? Give me the gun, kid. I'll do it. All right. It's time.
He loses everything in one day. That's um that's really rough. I have a feeling that's the end of the episode as well. Well, the episode of the game, not my episode. Yeah. All right. Well, we'll let this run a little bit long. Yeah. I knew I should have stopped it back there. Oh. Well. You want to talk? Uh-uh. You, uh, understand what happened? Yes. Okay. What do you think it's about? What Chuck said. What Chuck said? That what happened to Duck would happen to me. The fuck he did? I swear. I'm sorry. I kind of took some sense into it. Don't be mad. That's probably a bit rough to say. Hey. How you doing? care what reasons you had for doing it. No reason to go and tell my girl she's gonna end up dead. Because she is. I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. But y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do you know? I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah, and then what? I figure it out. Well, get to figuring, because it'll be on top of us before you know it. Look, sit down with the girl and hash it out. Find a map, for Christ's sake. I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you... It won't. If it were, you gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. She's a little girl. And she'll die a little girl if you treat her like one. You gotta consider her a living person. That's it. You're either living or you're not. You ain't little, you ain't a girl, you ain't a boy. You ain't strong or smart. You're alive. Look at her hair. You got her running around with a mop that's gonna act like Velcro to any hand swinging its way. Find some scissors in my pack and take care of that hair before Walker does it for you. And then show her how to use a gun. Because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. I don't mean to tell you how to do your job. But too many people have died already. They have. And seeing another little girl die might just do me in. I hear you. A plan, a haircut, and a gun. It's good advice. It's something. I did like the advice, and uh, I, it was a real shame that I wasn't able to just agree with him. I had to go through the whole, oh, no, I'm shocked. Because in the end, we did get there, but um, I did agree with the guy. Um, I hadn't thought of the haircut, but definitely she needs to grow up the same way, you know, Carl did in uh, the show and probably in the comics. I haven't actually read the comics. It's probably bad form, but uh, I haven't. All right, guys. Uh yeah, I'm going to leave it there. Um, the episode's probably gone on far enough. We'll continue this little conversation with him and the rest of what we're doing in the next episode. Uh, I just hope there is something to actually do in the rest of this episode of the game uh, for the next episode of the show. So uh, thank you for joining me. Hopefully you enjoyed that episode. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. It really does help the channel. If you're new here, down below you'll find the subscribe button. If you subscribe, you'll get Fish Gaming videos in your YouTube mailbox every single day. All right, guys. I've been Fish. This has been The Walking Dead. And I'll catch you next time.